hello and welcome how are you doing today next I am planning to show you that how I assemble this uh, Toyota VVTi engines this uh, this oil pump and, and and this is assembly project and and here here are those parts what I install in here and there are those bolts in here and and first part what we need to assemble is where we start is this core core module this is like this this main oil pump block and there is this this Toyota icing part and uh, this oil pump belongs to this uh, Toyota gasoline engine 1.6 or 1.4 or 1.8 liter engines and first we insert in here this there is this hole where I insert this pressure sensor this is uh, this is this oil pump this sensor and, and there is that kind of metallic part in here and this part this area is in hole and in that area this spring belongs in that way and, and first I drop this this part I drop that part in in this hole in this way and then I insert that spring in there in this way and then I have here this locking bolt what becomes in here in that way and I rotate and, and, and now I need to do final thickening for that bolt and there should be at least one newton meter this force and torque in that bolt okay and this was okay and then we go in inside and I I set up this this pump in that position and then we have those two fuel pump parts and there is important to remember that there are symbols there is like an an like neutral in here and then in that other side there is one metallic point and then also this in N symbol and this this metallic point must be in this up upside in this way now there is this there is this point it is in there okay and this is good and then I need to install also that part and there was also idea that there is this point and in symbol in here and this becomes also in same way in this way I, I, it goes in goes in okay now it's in there inside okay good Food and and then we have next step is that we have this cover what goes in here so that, that that there is this cover and I I turn that in other other side and there are those screw places in here here one two and three and those screws controls like 
take those screws <coughs> in here. They are that side kind of screws and this goes in, in that hole. In that hole first. Okay, and I have here screwdriver, crosshead. Here and I try again. Okay, and, and this is a, <coughs> this is then <coughs> a special bolt. What is designed in this oil pump? This is not not standard screw or bolt, and it goes very nicely there. And then I need to insert those two. There is next. Okay, there is this next one. Okay, now it's in there, and then the final one it is in, it is in there. This goes in there, and then when when these parts are in here, I need to tick then these bolts. I I I like to say that very ticked. And, and next, I am I am planning to, and also that bolt too. I am planning to go take my this. This uh, special heat heat uh, screwdriver, and I am planning to hit these bolts very thick. And this is my next job. And this is important that these jobs there is this 10 newton meter or 20 pounds force in these screws also. Okay, and, and we continue. Okay, and then this part is in this workbench and I have thickened these parts between these two metallic parts and now this is in thickened in there and first step is that I need this special hammer screwdriver what idea is that when I hit in that side then this this head makes force like hitting force in there and first of that I I insert I tick these bolts in my hand and now it's in there in that and I I tick those in my hand this was first one and then second in here here and then the last last one okay and, and next I use this hammer force that I insert that in here and I Little bit hammer, a little bit hammer, all of these three bolts that I I like that. Okay, and now I believe that that these are enough thick, and then we have this one bolt left in this upper area what was that nut and for that I need I need socket that is in here and this sides is it is like this uh, 22 millimeter is the sides 22 and 22 millimeter and that kind of socket and, and that bits also I, I I I like I like to tick them this like quite well. Then 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 ten newton 
better force then I use also the fans I insert the socket in there and then I did that that part okay now it's it's thick this bolt okay and this was the that idea that how to how to assemble this this uh, oil pump and next we go to install that pump in this motor engine engine body and we this is our next step okay and next part is that we need to install this oil pump back in this crankshaft axle and this is like this crank crank shaft axle and uh, then, then this oil pump when we look in there inside there are those uh, these shapes in this hole that there are strike line and this strike line must come with that that base in there this surface in here and and we can rotate this this oil pump so that if we have something tool like that and we insert that in, in here and then we and then when we rotate that this oil pump this part moves and then we need to adjust that part so that is that it is in same 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 way as then this crankshaft axle and I rotate that little bit and then I install that back carefully and it goes in there in one okay now it went and then when I little bit rotate and I press that it goes really nicely in there but before of that now it's in right I need to install in there new gasket it's mandatory that we have new gasket what comes in here in in that way and we check that everything is fine okay there is gasket and then I install that that oil pump back in there a little bit movement and now now this pump should be should be in right I check only that that, that everything is okay there was small and it's it should go go I was small plastic part in there no, and now it goes in in there very very thick in there and then I had these bolts four four pieces and this goes in there and in there and in in, in here here is one and then there is next one and final one is in here okay and then then we need this socket what size is 10 millimeter and this socket fits in these bolts and then I first thicken these bolts and there, there was this force what was 10 newton meters all of these bolts and then I when I rotate these bolts I continue when I have rotated this all of these bolts in end and next I thicken this okay okay and now now I have now I have installed these these bolts in there and I need to do this final thickening I insert that 
my socket in there and, and then I thicken this first and then that one in here and then this one in here and then this one in here and that one in in here and then again again this one in here and and the moment was 10 newton meters and I I tick this now in my hand because I think that that I tick this carefully that I don't I don't destroy those but moment tool is the better way then this one okay and, and now I think that these bolts are enough thick I check all of those that they are in thick they're good and and then then when this oil pump is in, in here I, I use that picker tool that fits in that position where is this small hole and I test that is this my motor and parts still moving and it's, it seems that, that everything moves moves nicely Okay, good. Good and, and now this oil pump is in there and we can we can continue in in next part. Okay and thank you for watching.